wanting a wig that you can just seamlessly like blend in with your own because you don't like that fake looking hairline you don't like cutting your own lace and you don't like a fake parting this is your wig if you've been putting your wigs like back a little bit and taking out your own hair this is what you've been wanting hey guys so i got another human hair wig for you guys to review and this time i'm so excited because it's one i've really been wanting for a while it's a v-part wig and it's from shein if you guys can't tell i'm wearing it right now it's really hard to detect because my own hair is out and it's blended with this wig if you guys have been wanting a wig that you could just blend your own hair with so this way there's no fake hairline there's no fake part there's no lace to cut this is going to be your wig and i'm going to share with you how to apply it how to make it look realistic how to blend your own hair it's so comfy to wear and i've been wanting one for so long so i'm so happy shein sent me one to review for you guys but let's get into it and let me share with you guys a little bit of details about it so it is 22 inches long it's a super long one there's different lengths i'll get more into that later they definitely have different lengths different colors and all that good stuff it is 180 percent density but honestly if i take all the hair and bring it forward like that's a really good amount it looks so natural i could put it behind my ear obviously this is my own natural hair right here but it doesn't bulk up my ear or anything like that it really creates that illusion that it's your own hair and you have nothing going on maybe people might think you're wearing extensions but that's like about it they also claim that this is a hundred percent human hair so we are putting it to the test into this video i'm gonna use a curling iron and we are gonna curl this wig like you guys can see i have a few waves going on i brushed the heck out of it but i wanted to put it to the test and add a little bit of heat so we're going to do that if you guys want this wig before we get into it you guys can use this coupon code i'll put it right here onto the screen it's wigs for you if you use this coupon code when you buy your wig you're gonna get a whole bunch of free products i am so impressed with shein that they're actually sending this out because these are so expensive to buy them on their own they're giving you a mousse so this is a lace tinted mousse they're giving you a wax stick so this way whenever you have flyaways like if you guys can see maybe i have a little bit of flyaways I did use a little bit of oil, so I don't think there's any. But if you have any flyaways, you can use a wax stick, and that's going to take all those flyaways down. It comes with two brushes. You also get these to lay down your wigs, and you get glue and glue remover from them. Like, that is so much in here. That is insane that they give that. So if you guys are getting a wig, you better be using that coupon code because that is completely all free, and you're going to get it with any wig that you get. But let's get into it. Let me show you how exactly I applied it and all the details about this wig and, like, how to use it. The package took around one week to arrive. It was so quick, and if you guys are interested in, like, learning how to take care of your wigs, you don't know anything about Shein wigs, and you want to make sure that you keep your human hair wigs proper you want to make sure that you're washing them properly they have instructions here how to apply wigs how to take care of them everything that you need to know is in this pamphlet that comes inside of the package it also has all these discounted like little coupon things going on these little cards if you guys want crazy discounts their facebook page has massive discounts all the time we got to make sure that you're following their official pages so i'll put their official pages right here so you can make sure that you're following the right one but let's get into it so how this wig works let me just open up the box and grab the wig i've already taken it out of the bag and everything so when you receive the wig, it actually has these two little strands right here, and you're just gonna need to snip them off, and then it's going to look something like this. And inside, you have these four clips that go all around this V part, and basically what that is, is you're gonna leave your own parting right here and put that around. But what I'm doing differently today, instead of leaving the part where it's like all of a wig right directly right here, I'm gonna leave the framing of my hair around my face out and if there's wind blowing or anything you're never gonna see the wig it's gonna be so hard to detect this wig and that's what I'm planning on so that's how I'm gonna put my hair up so I'm gonna take this parting right here and I kind of want to go back pretty far because the back of the wig is something like I'm gonna have to have hair that goes over the back part so let me grab this I don't know if that's going to work we're going to see it's my first time actually applying this and I'm going to make sure I have a V section. That seems good. That seems like a lot, but maybe we're going to try it. That's what I'm going to try. We're going to see if it's going to work. I'm not sure. Let's clip that and leave some framing out. I think I need like that much. And that seems like a really good amount. I'll put this into elastic. I'm going to wrap it up like so and just have that in the box you get like a wig cap some people do put wig caps i feel like i wouldn't be able to 
and I'm just gonna try to go from here. In the back, there is some combs, so this is going to get shoved right here. I also have some combs on the side, so that's gonna go around here, and we have this stretchy band that's gonna go into the back. If you guys have a small head like me, you have these adjustable straps. What I like to do is kind of like put them on the tightest thing and then like connect them together, and that's just gonna make it super snug and like really tight to my head because Shein doesn't have like cap sizes. It's a one size fits all, so I have to make them like super snug and super small since I have a small head. But let's try and put this on directly. There's four up here, and there's a comb that's all the way in the back. Oh no, my hair's going down. And I'm just going to put that directly at the end of my V, and then try and clip these in. That actually looks really good so far. But it's just so fun that you don't have to have a full on wig anymore. You can leave your hair out. There you go. Let's take down the framing of the face and see if it worked. Wait. Okay, wait, if I put this back, did I leave enough out? I think so. That worked out perfect. Let me show you guys really fast what this is looking like so far. Volume. Okay, we're gonna have fun with this. I am going to curl this. We're gonna mix this in with my hair and just see how it looks but so far this is so good let me try and see how secure these clips are oh yeah that's not going anywhere the wind if it blows you can't see the actual wig and my hairline looks realistic oh this is perfect i'm gonna be able to wear this out and not feel like i'm wearing a wig or that anybody's gonna be able to detect it it's like all the way into the back i can make whatever parting that i want i did see a girl and what she did was is she took the four clips and because she wanted a side parting, she put it directly here instead of in the middle. But I left so much space, like the clips start about here. And so I left a lot of space so I could do like any parting that I wanted. But if you guys think that it's better just to put it onto the side, you could also do that. So we're gonna go in with the T3 automatic curling iron. And if you guys are not using this curling iron, I don't know what the heck you are using. Like, are you guys experienced at curling hair? Cause I cannot curl hair whatsoever. And this thing automatically curls it for me. And it's like the best curls come out every single time. So we're gonna use this. It's not hard on the hair at all, but this is human hair. So it is supposed to be able to handle this. It's supposed to be able to handle heat. So we are going to test that out and see if that actually is true or not. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take it from straight to curly. I've done a few just because it takes a really long time. There's so much hair. It's 22 inches, right guys? Like, there's a lot of hair. It's so low in density, I feel like, but it's a lot. So far, the wig is taking the heat really good. It's curling. See this pretty curl right here? It's so pretty. Of course, it's like human hair. It's supposed to be able to handle heat, but you never know, right? Like, that's why I like to test them out in front of you guys, just to make sure that it is 100% like human hair and that it can handle heat and that you can style it because if you're gonna have a wig like this where it's half half where you're leaving your actual hair out and you're blending it you're gonna need to style it somehow let's brush it out now you can't even detect it it looks so natural and so good with my hair you could even make like layers and that would just like blend in with your hair so much better too. Okay, this little section right here is not looking as curly as I like. That's my own hair. <laughs> it didn't take the curl as nice. Okay, I just brushed out all the curls. I wanted it to be like, you know, not crazy. Like, see, this is still crazy for me. I wanted it to be like really brushed out and my, my hair is not doing me justice. But okay, so you can see right here that I'm going a little bit bald. I am going through postpartum hair loss and I've been losing a lot of hair lately. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go in with this. We're gonna add some hair fibers. This has been helping me so much. There you go. And I'll add a little bit here just to thicken up the look of my hair. I think that's good. We'll go in with a little bit of Amika oil. Run that through the hair so it's not frizzy and looks super pretty. That'll take down the waves even more, which I want. So now I'm gonna do a 360 for you guys. You can see the back, what it looks like, the sides. 
It looks so natural. The top of my head, you can't even see it. Where is it? You have no idea. This looks so realistic, so natural. And I feel so good because I don't have like that fake hairline in the front. I don't feel insecure about my, you know, my parting. I love wigs that I could like blend my hair in with. And I feel like every time I got wigs, I know my mom does that where she'll get a wig, but she just wants to leave the front of her parting out and she can't do that. Like, cause it kind of looks weird, but this is meant for that. So if you guys have been wanting a wig where you can blend your natural hair with it and it looks realistic and good, like this is your wig. This is a B part wig. And this is what you've probably been missing out on. So if you guys want this exact unit, I'm going to put the product ID right here under the screen. And if you want 15% off extra, because I think it's already on sale. If you guys want an extra percentage off, you can use my coupon code clarity 15, and that's going to give you some money off. I don't think you can use it at the same time as the wigs for you coupon. So if you want all of those like extra like products, I don't think you can use them at the same time, but if you guys rather the 15% off, you can use my code and I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys in the next. Bye guys.